Welcome back everyone, we're back here at um, Concord um, slash the Museum of Freedom just to talk to um, Jay, Jack um, to the um, last episode the um, we got that quest so we had to come back here he did um, somehow manage to get all this stuff here somehow and um, it's a very clean mug I must say. <clears throat> Howdy, Slick. Good to see you again. Uh, how are things? How are things going? Not bad, not bad. As you can see by the crate, I managed to get the comm hub back. Although it wasn't easy, let me tell you. I've got the hub inside if you'd like to see it. I'll take a look, sure. All right, follow Again, me. you'd think like that they are like fix cars up in this game, use them for transporting stuff. Ooh, that's new. There it is. Ain't she a beaut? Although sadly not ready for service just yet. In fact, I couldn't even turn it on. But I have been able to give the old gal a good going over. Got a rough understanding of the hardware. Ah, uh, yep. Go ahead, I'm listening. Well, judging by the internals, this thing mostly appears to be a giant processor. My guess is that it operates as a kind of ASAM switchboard. Connecting and communicating. Wow, what if we'll get to um which makes sense really build here in Concord. It's called the Com Hub. Because again, now, I've always wanted that. So if, if this mod does add really add, add it so I can build here, that'd be awesome. Cool things. Well, tell me about Well, for example, remote management, mass software updates, division of settlement labor. Because I was just thinking, if that's like to um, control all the uh, AM set things, maybe I have to build one in each settlement. Which then, if he's got one here, technically so this could be made by a settlement, which it really could be. Really begin to rebuild the Commonwealth. I'm on board. When do we start? In order to get things going, first, we need to turn this thing on. And for that, we're going to need some serious power. Uh, I'm afraid my little generator just ain't going to cut it. However, as luck would have it, just a couple of feet below us is all There's one of the, um, thing to Bob. Go on. Concord has a municipal plutonium well. Probably used to power every oh. building in town. Yeah, and like the it's museum friend is the giant generator. All you need to do is turn it on. That is, if you wouldn't mind helping out. I'm on it. It's as good as done. <laughs> Once you're down there, find something that looks like a big old generator. Do what you need to start it up, then head on back. Right. Big and yet, like, this place could honestly be a massive settlement, because, like, if you said, like, people say, stay around here, like, you'd wall off, like, say, that building, that building, like, balled up these, as, like, they have. And then go around to, like, the back of this, um, here. You'd be able to make a platform up to there. Um, you get, go back here and possibly down there. Depending on how many people you have. But, um. Yeah, I thought you'd just. It'd be this more of a, um. Go in the, the Museum of Freedom and, um, hook something up to there. Because you could. Again, if this was a real life. If you need that generator, you'd hook it up to the nuclear one downstairs. You'd open up the, um, door. The main door. Then, like, the little door to the, um. Like that back part of running lead through it and you're done. Um so I that. I think this is new, this area. Cause I've been through it multiple times, I've never seen that. Uh oh. That is not good if there are already things dead here. Wait, rat roach? Rat roaches? Plural. Multiple ones. Um, on the other side. Hmm. I 
Oh, or maybe this isn't, um, maybe this isn't normal era because it has a minute man. I thought that was like an oh my! I was a bit of sour. I thought that was a more rat alive, but no, it's it's dead. Oh, that's so annoying! Yeah, there we go. Buff our mentax. Um. Oh. I know the other thing, yes, the other place said that's where I meant to go, but I can't actually get in there, so. Okay. Uh huh. A button. Look at how to restart the reactor. Okay. Um, terminal. Okay. Ah, uh, da da da. The giant red button, that's how we've done that. I mean, if uh, the power goes down, just hit the red button. You realize that. Da 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 da. da, 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 da. But we've hit the button. Oh, why, man? This is Preston. Because it says that about rebuilding the Mutman. Um, but no, I think this is more of the um, other thing. Um, what about a gas uh, generator to help kickstart the generator? Just in case it goes down, and if the gas generator stops working, then I don't know. Kick it. Uh oh, and hit the that big red button to keep. <laughs> right. So, stop here. Um, apparently, there's like a gas generator. Well, there it is. Huh. That's working. Wait, what was that? Oh, that was him. Alright, so that should be working now. Oh, we're getting rads. Uh, okay. That wasn't too hard, I suppose. Just cause, again, like, sort of odd thing in a sense, like, like, you couldn't, like, have, like, explosive charges, sort of things, like those doors that are, like, chained. Oh, my look. Plus, I honestly think that, like, if you're in power armor, like, honestly, cause of how, like, much, suppose, Strength and plus weight would be in power armor. A chain door wouldn't, should not be able to exactly stop you. Again, if like you're in full power armor, because like it's power armor, it, it, it'd have a heap, it'd have a heap of weight to it. So it really should stop really anything. Where am I going? There it is.
Loading. Oh, there we go. It's just about to get a drink of water then and uh, finish loading. Right. You should have all the power you need now. Yeah, I noticed. When the power came back, it blew out half the bulbs in here. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to replace those. But the important thing is, Hi. we now have power. So, the next step... Next step is, we try turning on the comm hub. All right then, let's try powering this thing up. Now let's see here. What? Okay, um, connect this I believe that's a new model. What he's doing, that might be something from the Institute. I don't know. That tool. We're ready to give this uh, a go. Quite sure that's new animations. Uh, best if you stand back. Oh, he did. Huh? <laughs> okay. <coughs> that didn't exactly <coughs> go to play. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. <coughs> <coughs> to be honest. I was kind of worried. This we got too much power. I've been sitting around in use for so long. And so many of its parts have degraded. Seems even with enough power, there's no getting around blown out capacitors and pair of semiconductors. <laughs> I mean, a nuclear try. reactor sort of thing would have so much stuff like energy sure coming out of it. So. Give me a day or two. Maybe I could swap out some of the busted parts, clean a few tubes. It might be enough. I know it may not seem like it, but this one has to to wait and now. Don't worry. I haven't lost faith in you. <laughs> that, mm hmm. Okay. If we want to start rebuilding the Commonwealth, I better get to work. Mm hmm. Thanks for your help today. I'll put out a radio message again oh. when I've got news. Take care. Okay. Huh? Oh, that's finished now. Well, well, well. Um, don't know what to do now. Uh, see, I was thinking, um, okay, things I have. Yeah. I don't want too many settlements because everyone is wondering, um, the way I normally do my settlements and stuff is normally, or with the supply lines, is I get the, um, slight spoiler alert, I suppose. The mechanist lair and um, build uh, all the supply lines from there because I usually do it out of like assault con robots. Um, so I don't want too many settlements just so their things will go down. So, what I'm thinking, um, I don't know what to I might off camera um, do a, a settlement battle, battle, I suppose, in here. Cause um, I you can still see how I've got here. I've got like the little turret for now. That'll be destroyed probably really quickly. Um, what can I make? Not much. Um, let's see these ones. Things are slowing down, sort of. Captain. Well, how does that work? A specialist has to admit that. Um, and yet, that one costs more, but he only has, like, the normal combat armor. That looks like Preston. That is the T60 armor. Wow, that dude looks really small. Liberator, I have no idea what he's going to look like. They got the pyro unit, which is going to be cool. 
Don't know. And don't know. But again, these have like massive things for defense, so the champion. I'm gonna have to find out about all that. Um just don't know if I can actually do any settlement things yet. Um what would they be under? Play creation club. Um so I can either choose to do the, the fake distress signal or the animal one. I might um hmm. You know what? I'm gonna have this 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 here. Um might build generator. Small generator. Um, so I might, next episode might be, um, just doing a bit of settlement sort of defending, because I don't have too much ammo, but I think the, um, rays that should drop the ammo, so, I don't know, um, I might, I've done that. I might see what I need for, like, the new, well, not new, but, like, an, a, um, yeah, it's one of these sort of things. Um, I need more screws. So I'm gonna need two more and gun that arm and that, but um, that should be able to be able to be done throughout the other thing, because um, I don't know. My dog is like currently snoring. I'm hoping that he's actually not picking up on the uh, audio. I know there's like an automatic receiver. Or at least there should be. Was it one of these ones? Oh, so yeah, it's, it is this one. Um. Right, so these ones have that. Honestly, tell the thing about pipe pistols are probably the best in some sense for survival mode. So you do more damage to others, do more damage to you. Because they're, they're so easy to modify. Um, so that's my level now. Um, we'll take one we've done that. Huh. So I might, um, what can I have? Probably off camera, I'll do a few like, um, miscellaneous things, because I know I should go quickly travel to, um, Diamond City. Um, because there, there is like a, a bounty board here. I do know that. Um, so I might do like a few bounties. That's something I never exactly knew of at first was about the bounty boards. I know there's a mod to refix up the um, combat zone because that was originally going to be a um, cut content that was going to be like you'd go in there and fight in the arena and caps so on and so forth. And then I think um, the comp oh I'm not going to say who it is but the the one you get, the, the companion you get there that you're going to get them at the um, like you're going to beat them and then you'd be able to have them as a companion, originally. But that got scrapped, so... Yeah. No, we're not having that at all. I do know they do have that for the... Cons... Uh... Um, what's we call it? Um... PC. But not for Xbox, sadly. I think it's called Combat Zone Restored. Um, but that would have been an interesting thing. Because again, you'd, you'd be able to make a fair few caps. But that's probably what I'll do on this, is I'll get off camera, I'll um, go do these bounties. We've got raiders. Okay. So I'll, I'll do a few of these off camera and level up another time. 
and um, buy some more materials and like um, mod out a pipe pistol for next time. Because um, I'll probably, next episode will probably be either um, helping out Jake or um, defending a not defending yeah like doing a settlement defense defense thing with pro raiders possibly or gunners so. That will be for next time and uh, don't forget to subscribe.